We have got something awesome showing. Y'all got to check this out. Go ahead and get it. Show it blue? to me. It is blue. Oh, my oh. God. Oh, my gosh. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. oh my um, goodness. Don't drink it. That's it's 100 fresh. years old. No, don't do it. Oh. Mm. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> back out today Tristan slinging some dirt me and Clayton are holding the trees and the dirt down and uh he stopped and he said I got a coin I got a coin and I was like no way and he brought it up here and we cleaned it off and you see it says good luck coin and that's not the cool part the cool part is right there it says Birmingham Alabama let's see if I can get it to focus for y'all you can make out the ala and on the back side it says Oster Bros Furniture Company and it says like one dollar towards 55 use and then it like goes down on the scales so that's actually really neat and this hole not this hole a hole a few hundred feet back behind us last week uh one of our buddies actually dug a barber dime from 1906 so <clears throat> we were sitting here talking about how we need to make us a sifter instead of just sitting up here holding down the trees in the dirt like we're doing be sifting through the tailings that we're throwing out of the hole because there's obviously good stuff on top of all of these marbles and stuff that we're finding and uh i was unaware until a couple weeks ago how valuable some marbles are so uh, you may see us start sifting here soon anyways we'll get back to you when we find something else check out all these marbles that come out of the hole kind of got a bad sun shot right here they're all nice we were talking about back then if your mom threw your marbles out it'd be the equivalent of somebody throwing your uh <laughs> throwing your xbox away today <laughs> that was all they had to play with back then uh we're starting to find some hutch stoppers so we're getting pretty close to finding some good stuff we'll uh get back with you when we do we're seeing some aqua down in here clayton is right in front of him it's a blob piece of crap does it say the uh does it have the devil on the bottom is that one I, is that one no it says root that one count as a soda nope no, keep going no. Definitely not a soda. That's, that's cool though. We're, we're rotating out today. Our big holes have all caved and got us into a spot where we're all sharing a hole again. So uh, our rules of the game are one embossed soda and the next guy gets in behind you. Uh, a lot of watching, a lot of sitting, but it's, it's fun this way still. It gets all about the association, right? Just pull a Deacon, Deacon Brown out. He's looking at the date code to see if... 1913. Like the server? Alright. Alright, keep going. Got, got a hut showing down here, guys. Oh. You can tell by the A on it. More than likely, it's going to be an Alabama bottling company. Could be a crown top, couldn't it? Does the crown top variant have an A on the bottom? I'm not sure about that. I know it's the exact same on the front and the back. Um, I'm not sure about the base though. It's a little I loose. It. I saw it move. I don't know about the, base the light helping you. <laughs> yeah, I guess kind of actually. See if you can snag that sucker. Oh, it's still stuck in there. Yeah, in there. Let's see if she'll come. Oh my goodness. Woo! <laughs> 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 At least you know that ain't ever been dug back there. <laughs> You did a good job planting that one from the house, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right. Uh, golly. Still won't move. That's what's holding it in there. It's got to be close now. Got to be. I mean, it's halfway out. <laughs> <laughs> it's still 
<laughs> it's like the Excalibur bottle. No kidding. Man. <laughs> That thing is in there. Good. You're going to pop that thing out and there's going to be three more sitting right behind it. Guarantee you. That's right behind that Deacon Brown, isn't it? Yeah. I'm telling you, I don't know why there's so much Birmingham stuff over here unless this is railway dump. That's the only thing that makes, unless they somehow ship them down here on a train to sell them to the miners. But I don't, I don't know if anybody actually did that, but that's, that would kind of make sense. It's got to be this. <laughs> Come on. Ah, there she is. <laughs> oh, you got it. Yes, sir. Awesome. Is yeah, it company or works? Company. Company. Yeah. Woo. All right. Good deal. <laughs> All right, guys. Just had a little collapse. You got a bottle right here. Go pull it out and see. It's a hutch. Oh, wow. And it's another Alabama bottle. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. It's, it's in, a nice one. It's embossed nicely. And no cracks, no chips. All right, we'll keep going. That's pretty neat. I don't know if I've ever seen it. All right, we caved in. We got another one showing. It's going to be newer because it's at the top. And oh, it's a Red Rock. That's oh, a Red Rock. Nice. Atlanta, Georgia. Cool. That's a little different. So, all right. Is we'll that a clear one? Yeah, it's clear. They're aqua too, right? Yep, they are aqua. Cool. All right, guys. Good we'll bottle. Going. Good bottle. Oh, good deal. After uh, after oh, yeah. caving again, got a nice little milk of magnesia. It's not the screw top; it's the cork top. Still pretty common, but still a neat bottle. Has a patent date August twenty first, nineteen oh six. All right, we'll keep going. Clayton got one showing down here. We're expecting the worst, hoping for the best. That's right. Oh, oh nice. Viva. nice. Wow. Nice. That's kind of cool. That is cool. For sure. Y'all check that out. Viva Bottling Works. Very cool, man. That's different. Oh, yeah. All right. We'll keep going. Favorite part of cave-ins is the uh, 20 stuff falling out like this right here. Nice soda water. It's from Birmingham. That's what we call the pokey variation. That's what I'm going with. So we're trying to cave in this top part. Let's yeah. see. Here you go, take a look at that. We'll see what... Birmingham? Yeah. yeah, it's Birmingham. It's starting to creep a little bit. It's alright though. Yeah, that's why we're doing it now. Oh, there's a cave on top. Right there, it just sunk. Right here. Yeah, it's sinking. Alright, who wants to get up there and jump up and down on it? <laughs> just just kidding. Just kidding. Alright, we'll be back with you all in a minute. Check that one out, guys. It's got a nice little crack in it. And just another uh, cave in find. It's a neat bottle, though. Art Deco, huh? Yeah. What's that, late 20s? Uh, let's see. I think so. Something like that. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. We got some dang work ahead of us to dig this out, but we got a lot of room to work now. Y'all check this out. Do you, do this is a see? that's a first, the, man. <laughs> let's see that. What is it? It's the CC Simpson Bottling Works Tuscaloosa. Tuscaloosa Hutch. Yeah. Holy cow! Are yeah, y'all check that friends? Tuscaloosa bottle out. My gosh, that's neat, dude. Never seen a Tuscaloosa bottle come out of here. Never. And the first one's a. Hey, fresh. hold it up a little closer to the camera. That's crazy. And the first one is a hutch. Wow. And that one fell out of the roof. You didn't even That is pop so that cool. Thing. That is awesome, guys. Well, that made the daggum hole worth it. There you go. I don't know. Man, that's awesome. Just pulled out a base script alicola right behind the Tuscaloosa hutch. Starting to shape up a little bit. We did some extensive excavating today, though. I mean, we moved a ton of dirt. And uh, we're really just trying to set ourselves up for the coming days. But stuff starts rolling out, stuff starts rolling out, right? That Tuscaloosa Hutch, though, that's just a, that's an impressive bottle to find. Beautiful bottle. Tuscaloosa is actually spelt with a C, and this was before that, and it was named after named after Chief Tuscaloosa, the Indian. So that's pretty neat, or Native American, whatever's 
politically correct. Really neat though. All right, we're gonna do some shoveling out. Guys, I'm stoked, I just dug this. This is my first Eagle Bottling Works from Bessemer, Alabama. Isn't it a beaut? Man, it's beautiful. Great bottle. Yeah, light bulb. <laughs> Look at there, guys. Eight foot down, you're gonna find a light bulb hole. How does that work? How does that work? I'm gonna go home and plug that up. It probably still works. Aniston base. Aniston base. We had a cave in. Right before the cave in, I saved this man. I'm so stoked about that. You pulled that Alabama Walling Works hutch out too at the same time, didn't you? Yeah. There was another hutch. And a CC company right in front of it. There's the CCC. Very nice. And these are always neat to find. Hoyt's 10 cents. Let's see, I just got the 10 cents. Oh, yeah, my bad. Guys, yeah, I appreciate y'all tagging along for the adventure today. We'll shoot some more uh, in the coming days and we'll get some fresh footage out to you ASAP. Oh, there's a. Ah! Oh, very excited. But we'll uh, we'll have some more stuff coming out here real soon. Either way, if y'all would, please like and subscribe. <laughs>